Here's how simple it is to recreate this colorful retro text effect here in Illustrator. Step one, let's go and select the type tool, type in whatever you want, scale it up. I gotta go with the Arial, a regular actually. And we're gonna go down here to the appearance panel. If you don't have the appearance panel, you can go to the windows and select appearance. We're gonna go down here and add a fill. This way is gonna add a fill and a stroke. I'm gonna change up the fill to some lighter gray and I'm gonna make a new fill color. Let's go down to this fill color, change it up. I'm gonna go with orange. And from here, we're gonna go to the facts, distort and transform, select transform. Let's go to the vertical, add one, and we're gonna increase the copies quite a bit. So it's gonna create this really cool extrusion. In my case, I'm gonna go with 60 copies, click OK. And now I'm gonna go ahead and drag this fill to this little plus to create a new duplicate. Now let's go to the bottom fill, change up the colors. I'm gonna go with some stronger orange. And we're gonna go to the transform. And we're gonna add plus 60 more copies. Let's see what happens, check this out. It is going to expand the extrusion even more and create a colorful extrusion. I'm gonna drag this fill again to the plus. Now we're gonna go and change up the color again. I'm gonna go with some strong red. Let's go to the transform and we're gonna add plus another 60. Click on enter and there you go. And I'm gonna repeat this one more time. Plus fill and I'm gonna go with a blue. Let's go to transform, add another plus 60. Click OK. And not but least, we also got the stroke unused. So I'm gonna switch it up to some light gray. And I'm gonna add another distort and transform on this. Go to the vertical and just decrease it to, I'm gonna decrease it with minus 10. Click OK. And pretty much this is how we make this fully customizable text effect here in Illustrator. Thanks for watching.